So that's the uh, Mountain 25. The North Face Mountain 25. Used it once or twice. We've had it for about four years. And it's still brand new like it was yesterday, the day we bought it. And let me show you what's inside. By the way, this is the Summit series. It took us a little bit longer to install it than we normally would do. Yeah. And here we go. Obviously, when you put it down and everything, it's going to be fine. So, why am I pitching this out in my backyard? screen down it's very simple very 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 simple is I'm going for a big hike by myself yes. Thank you, um, next weekend leaving after work at Friday and then straight to Mount Arrow Piles so what I'm going to be doing is a bit of trekking but more rock climbing and checking out some of the mountains up there I haven't <coughs> climbed out there for a while so I'm going to go out there, just relax, chill out, do some vlogging, some reviews on the products I've bought recently for climbing and obviously tents and arrow piles itself. Yeah, so this is the Mountain 25, two person, probably can fit three people but it will be squashy. Now this is, isn't a, a, a tent to trek long distances. Now we have taken this... Uh, the top it is just under five kgs with all the pegs and everything like that so it is heavy i wouldn't recommend doing any long treks if you're not doing any long if you're doing longer than two hours i wouldn't recommend uh taking this because this is a base camp um tent heaps of heaps of room now the review i'm doing right now quickly is we've had this Five years, four to five years. Taken out a few times. We've done a, a pitch tent, a quick tent pitch, a uh, quick review, compare it to the Hilleberg Image 3 GT, which is, I would recommend, the best tent on the market. But this isn't a tent to uh, put your head down at. I mean, it's at the moment. No pegs down at the moment, and it's holding up pretty, pretty easily. The inner layer is waterproof, somewhat, um, but if it's going to be a big storm, I wouldn't recommend it. The seals are already been um, the stitching seals are already been what they, I guess uh, siliconed from the factory, not like MacPack where you have to do it yourself. Double stitching, very very strong tent. Two person is like four pockets, pockets to hide your stuff. A little hook up here to hang your lights or anything that you need to hang up. You can put a string from there to there, so you can then close or vice versa. Anyway, you got four points or six points actually. Two entrances. Leave your boots out there. Got your bags all out there. So if I show you out here very quickly. This will obviously be pushed out. Put your boots out there, or your bag, whatever you want, whatever's close to you. You can exit that way as well. Half fly net. Which is good so you got a lot of air coming through. I'll leave that open. You can also fly net up there for ventilation so you also can open it up to have it fully open but mosquitoes is a bit of a pain now uh, you got your little window here as you can see and this is obviously go out as well two entrances from each side this will have enough room to put your boots and everything you can actually sit out there and cook in the snow can't wait to do that again velcro locks into there on each side my MJ hasn't done it yeah. Uh, very good tent. If 
for the price, thousand dollars. Probably for the cheaper than I guess, but uh, we've got uh, Wild Earth. Not, not getting paid to review their products. Nor am I sponsored, but uh, we bought this from Wild Earth. Look, we buy all our tents, they got good prices, good customer service, and they're dispatched straight away. Uh, so, what's going to happen is I'm going to hit harrow piles, do some mountain climbing, as rock climbing, um, a lot of abseiling. Yeah, so uh, getting ready for winter. So this is the mountain 25 by the North Face tent. Two person tent, four season, one fantastic quality. Don't forget to subscribe, uh, press the thumbs up, um, and also share it if you can. Anyway, take care guys. Talk to you later. Bye bye.